to day alive, you wake up and from the moment we're awake, our child has a disability and it is there constantly. But for that one hour a week when we come down to the Surf Life Saving Club, the disability is obsolete. Oh. It's gone. These kids are like no other that's there. They are like everybody else in society yeah. and that's what a parent wants. I think Can Do With Nip is um, something that you see them achieve things they wouldn't normally do for me. The can do is they can now go under a wave and the can do is they can go in the canoe, jump on a board, jump on a boot board and uh, it's a wonderful thing to see them progress and you see them achieve many things slowly. The can do is just a philosophy where before you couldn't get them in the water but now these kids are quite confident and they can go in the water. It's great. What do you think of special nippets? Uh, let's do it and let's do it in the flooding water, flooding stand. What about friends? Do you make a lot of friends here? Yeah, I of friends. What about going in the water? Is that one of the best bits? Uh, fun. As a, as a parent of a disabled child, we don't, we learn very early that you no longer compare your child to other children you compare your child to themselves and how they're progressing. I saw my, my son jump both feet off the ground for the, the very first time at this club. Um, I've never seen him get both feet off the ground together. He could lift one or the other, but not both at the same time. And to see him jumping with both feet off the ground, that, that gives you as much pleasure as watching a, your 18-year-old learn to drive and get their license. It's, it's, you, know, you get the same sort of pleasure. I think they're building friendships like, like we all do. Special Nippers for Mitch is one of activity, one on one with lifesavers, learning how to do extra things like waves and doing. Every week you come, you see them take another baby step towards you know, getting more confident in the water. For that hour that they're here, it makes them forget that they have a disability. It's just, they just feel like they're part of everybody else. They feel like, and I know in Katie's instance, she feels like she's like a lifeguard because she's out there doing the same things as what they're doing and having fun. But it's just her ability to be able to interact with people without disabilities and people with disabilities. They bring out the best in our children. That's the thing with the Special Nipper program. The kids don't feel like they do have a disability and being the parent of a child, you also don't feel like your child no longer has that disability for that time that they're here because they're accepted. They're included in what they're doing in the water, on the sand activities, and yeah, it's, it's a good feeling for a parent to see their child being able to um, interact with lifeguards and do the things at a different level to what the lifeguards are doing, but to make them feel inclusive and important. They bring out the best in our children. If you went to Bondi, would you love to be on Bondi Rescue TV show? Yes. You would, I thought so. You don't want to be rescued by anyone, do you? No. Oh, no. <laughs> Our kids deserve the best that we as parents can give them, and as a parent, I do the best and myself. But when you've got a program like Special Nippers, take it on board, enjoy it seeing what our children can show you that they can be just like the other nippers. Take it on board, go for it, you won't regret it. For that one hour a week when we come down to the Surf Life Saving Club, the disability is obsolete, oh. it's gone.